open the box. You just gotta do the mail. Ew, hair. And I don't have any, um... Scissors. Scissors to open it, so I'm using a key. <laughs> and this is, like, the um, I think it's called FPU, I think, Financial Peace University. And I guess once you open it, you become like a millionaire or something. I'm just kidding. Okay, hold those two, okay? So they don't open. So it tells me what it is. But they won't be. Wait. I'm gonna cut that part off. This is what it is. So, Financial Peace University. This is what I got in the mail. And... Look. Millions of lives changed. This okay. is awesome. So the person that purchased this for me is my cousin um, from LA. And I just, everything just seems so awesome already. <gasps> this is so cool. Your envelope system. So I guess this is a method of like saving up money and stuff. Your day, where, payment, deposit, balance. This is too awesome. Um, living on my own does require budgeting. And I guess I have my envelopes right here. So I have the envelopes here for the envelope system, which is a method of saving money. And I really love the pack, the, the case. And um, this also has like this online class that I'm working with, working on. And it's like an eight weeks course and super saving, relating with money, <clears throat> cash flowing planning everything this is pretty awesome Let's see what else and of course the welcome packaging the welcome packet or yeah and his so we'll leave this for last this is where it all begins this is mr dave ramsey oh you know what i think i actually um downloaded no i, did, I don't know if this is it because i actually downloaded the Oh yeah, this is it. I actually printed all my cousins, signed me up, and she paid for it and everything. She also sent me like the link and the website where I will be taking the classes. You know, like I said, it's eight weeks. <clears throat> I think it's about eight weeks. And I actually printed this out. The tell your story and everything. Um, but I guess there's actually a book for it, which is pretty awesome. And of course, his book which I will start reading Monday. And this is a Christian man, so there is nothing better than taking the advice of someone who follows Christ, in my opinion. And I love how the book starts with the Bible verse. And it says, the rich rule over the poor and the borrower is a slave to the lender. And it's funny because that's true like when you're in debt and you know you're you're working you're you're working to you know to pay off your debt so you're you're a slave to whoever you owe money to and this is pretty awesome it says financial peace forms and this is extremely cool i will talk about this more in my other videos and I will let you guys know how it's going for me and how living away from home, um, you know, if it's affecting or benefiting, benef <laughs> if it's, you know, beneficial to... What? What's harder? These are the kids, the, the, the weirdest, the weirdest kids ever. Huh? I said you guys are the weirdest kids ever. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> what was all of that, Sophia? That she was naked. <laughs> What? Everybody's That's naked! Well, I'm naked! No, this, this is gonna be a rated R video. It's gonna, Whoa, it's, what at the end it's, the house? it's gonna get spammed on YouTube. Why did they take off my shirt? Can you pass me my wallet, please? Yeah. Where is it? Right here. They take off my shirt. Can I? Dude, no, you can't take off your shirt. That's illegal in a lot of countries. No! Bye, you guys. Okay. Going. Put shoes on. Dude. Okay. Okay. So 
I bought a wallet at Ross. Hello. And I'm with the Tito Fisher. Oh, that's disgusting. Go, go call the cops. Alright. <laughs> I don't have a phone, you, d you d crazy girl. She. I'm not a crazy girl. I'm not a crazy girl. I'm not a print. A print. Oh my gosh, I'm not a crazy girl. Okay, no, it's not, it's not like so cold out here, but there's a little kid and he's, I mean, yeah, it's not even cold at all, but it's not that hot, it's just, it was just raining right now. Um, oh, yeah. It's Sábado más tranquilo, la verdad no había pasado, I haven't spent like a Saturday, so chill in such a long time. A ver. Okay. Um, you, I feel like having a boba that's the only delicious thing out here no i'm just kidding everything's good there's a lot of good buffets out here in las vegas um one of my next videos is gonna be about like like 10 things to do in las vegas let me just, let me show you this wallet i have not bought a wallet like at raw since i was like before i even like i don't know back then so oh i'm wearing the same sweater from this from the other video it's because this is the only thing that isn't cold, but isn't hot. So it's just perfect for this weather. At, we're at 85 degrees. So I bought this wallet. It's a Jessica Simpson wallet. Um, I do like her stuff, like undergarments, um, shoes and stuff. I don't, one of the sides is like whatever to me. But I was like, okay, this is actually pretty cool. Because sometimes I feel like saving the receipts, you know? And that is like a nice um, pocket for the receipts. I'm sorry, it's because I'm holding the camera with one hand. And the other side, um, I did want something where I can put my, where all my cards would fit like perfectly. So yes, this is it. I have my Nevada ID now, and I have my California one right there. My Universal Studio Pass, um, credit and debit cards. I only have one credit card. Well, three, but I don't use two of them because since I just, I, like I showed you guys right now about like the Dave Ramsey, I am trying to avoid, um, well, I, I didn't tell you guys, but I am going to avoid spending money, um, stuff like that. Like, oh, I'm like choking me. I mean, choking me. I meant to say choking and then in choking and in Spanish, I tried to say it in Spanish and I was like chocando, but chocando would be... I don't even know if that's a word, but anyways, so I'm on my way and I kind of want a boba, but I have like the kids are over, well the kids that live next door sort of are in the other house and I feel bad if I don't take them a boba, maybe I should if they're nice, just kidding, they're all nice, okay, so what was I saying, okay, so I had not um, bought a wallet, you know, oh no, I was talking about the saving, so sa saving money, yes, so Dave Ramsey, um, I've been reading a lot about him. Pretty smart man. And this person is going to think I'm crazy because I'm holding a selfie stick. That's because I haven't installed the thing that, I, that I'm going to install so that it can hold my camera. But he's going to be like, oh, and then her license plates are from California. Of course, it's always the Californians that come and mess it up for us. Sorry, sir. Try to be a good citizen out here. But yes. Um, okay, maybe the rain is like the rain and oh my gosh, like this lady is like top, not topless. Let me stop recording. She doesn't think I'm recording her. The streets out here are like a million times better. Um, like a thousand times better than back in LA. I actually love it out here. Um, I'm really happy I, I, I made this the decision of moving. It, it wasn't something that that oh I'm gonna move and let's see how it goes and you know it was it, it was more of a I need to either do something for my life or I need to do something for my life and and of course that was the only option so I had to do something for my life um, everything is cheaper out here and I feel that by me living out here I I feel like I have a be a better chance of of succeeding of, of of doing something good for you know good for myself not that I couldn't do anything good for myself back in, in LA but I mean 
really like for okay for starters everything is cheaper here gas um i drive a an suv truck well i mean i think i can call it a truck because it is made on like okay i, I drive a four uh forerunner and it is made the way a tacoma is like oh i forgot what the thing is called but it's a truck whatever so in LA I would pump um, gas and I would spend about 75 to 80 dollars here I spend about 45 to 60 dollars um, depending on the weekend because you know there's some weekends where there's events out here in Sin City and obviously gas goes up um, speaking of, you know now that I mentioned Sin City um yeah i've probably done the strip you know there's a whole bunch of sin and everything but there's also good buffets um as far as gambling and everything it's not something that calls my attention the truth since i moved i've only been i've only gone i haven't even gone to the strip i just drove through there once um and it was that's the day that jerry came and i went to go pick him up so i was like hey let's drive through the strip you know record the pretty lights and everything you know but, i mean as far as like slot machines yes there's slot machines everywhere there's slots there's there is slots machine at the airport um at, at every gas station i'm not sure if it's starbucks because i've never been at a starbucks like um just through the drive-thru so i don't know but no I, that kind of seems a little too ridiculous but hey you never know um there's albertson's at there's slot machines at albertson's um which is pretty crazy like hey i'm gonna go to the grocery store and get some milk oh and while i'm there i'm gonna you know gamble a few dollars no that's kind of weird that's totally weird um everyone is nicer here and you know people are nicer here um everyone is just happier than in la like some seriously like nothing against the city well a lot against the city the city is getting really trashy and i actually mean this and if someone gets insulted well i feel like i mean you're probably one of them who who i don't know you know like throws trash out and like you're dry like i have literally seen someone drive they pulled out their they rolled down their window whoop, they just throw out their trash like through the window and i'm like really yeah you know this, the city is pretty trashy um in, out here it's much cleaner I feel people care more about their city um, what else oh okay everything is cheaper except for nails I paid like $20 for a manicure I know like 25 almost $30 yeah almost $30 for a gel manicure and I was like what yeah that's um, that's the only thing that's like pricier um, let's see what else other than that I do love the city I feel there is seriously like a hundred things to do besides gamble and I will make a video of 20 free things to do in Las Vegas or you know something like that um, I will be going to LA next weekend and I'm very excited for that okay, so yes, I will be going to LA next weekend and I'm looking I um. I'm going to make a video of, you know, like my, my, my pet's tag, my tag, oh no, that sounds horrible. I think it's gonna, it's, well in Spanish is el tag de mi, el tag de la mascota. I am gonna make that video because I'm gonna see Rocky next week. Um, which reminds me, there's this girl that I started talking to, her name is Yadira. Um, on her YouTube, it, it's, I think it's uh, hold on I will link it down below but anyway she seems like a super outgoing girl she's a new youtuber she lives in Sacramento California oh, she lives in Northern California I'm going to block that out and um, I actually look forward to you know talking more with her with her she seems really cool outgoing like I said I'll, I'll link the video her link down below yeah, what and, did you just do? Okay, Abe. Do it. Open the door, Sophia. Open that one too. Open that one. This one. Yeah, but you have to move Wait, that. You have move, to move this. That. Move this. The green. Woo! I'm so 
sexy and I know it. Oh my god! <laughs> you guys are so fast. No, do it like your stomach. Tell me around, tell me around. Woo! Why does he have his shorts like that? Let's see. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Woo! Woo! That's not cool. Okay, dude. Oh, 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 oh. Anyways. Seriously, this has been the most relaxed Saturday of my life. Um I'll be sharing I'll be I'll be sharing um I'll be keeping you guys updated. You got some from me. Yes you did. Look, mine was all mushed up but she put it apart. I'll be keeping you guys updated on the Dave Ramsey um Was that for real that I got some? On the Dave Ramsey um Financial Peace University. Peace. Okay. Okay, let's try to fix your problem now. What is it? What's going on? Is that for real that I teach some from Angel? Was that oh, for real? No, that's not for reals. I'll tell him. That's not for reals. Kids' problems.